Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Enclosure. Now we're ready to head back to Frank, who's probably dead. Well, hopefully he's not dead yet, because I need him to fix the scooter. After that, when I get back safely, he can die for all I care. He's served his purpose. Nope, he's not dead yet. Or is he? Shank! Okay, let's see. Give... Oh, God. Sorry, I can't spell that. Carburetor. Wait. Yeah, I know. I want to... I guess I have to... To Frank? Oh, okay. Look here, Bates. I found a carburetor. Hey, you actually found one, Goodman. Great. It was nothing, Bates. Really. You decided to tell nobody about your findings for the time being. Good idea. Keep Play it close to the vest. There, I fixed it. We can go now, Goodman. That's great. Let's go, then. After a long, cold journey, you return to the station, just in time because a heavy snowstorm is taking its form. Alright. Home at last, you say. Yeah. But what's happened since we've been gone? How much you want to bet almost everyone's already dead? Hey, that's strange. The generator status light is flashing red. There must be something wrong, Frank says. Nah, not good. Yes, there's something very wrong, Goodman. The display tells me that the reason is that the reason of this error is overheating. Jesus, Bates, what does that mean? This means that if I don't fix this problem at once, the generator will explode. Holy Mary! Can you can you fix it? I'll try, Goodman. I'll try. In the meantime, get out of here, because it might explode. Good idea! Uh... Hey. No. I want to save on this. Okay. Frank is desperately trying to fix the generator. Big generator provides electricity, blah blah blah. Let's bother him. He's not doing anything important. Making any progress, Bates? I'm working on it, Goodman. What's that? Did that make a sound? How did this happen, Bates? I haven't got a clue, Goodman. I don't know if I heard a sound or if it was just me. Need any help, Bates? This is a one-man job, Goodman, but thanks. I'm surprised he hasn't, like, gotten mad at me ever since that one time. He actually really did mean it, I guess. Better not disturb Frank Bates any further, Mike. It's a very dangerous situation and Frank needs his full attention. No! Disturb. Kick. Bates, you're not that violent. You don't know me very well, apparently. Here's how we fix it. We just bash it over the head with uh, the fire extinguisher. By the head, I mean the machine. Nope, okay. I guess whatever. That'll probably explode as soon as I leave. We'll just go up since... Hey, I'm wearing my coat inside. Maybe it won't care anymore. Whoa. For a minute, I was like, graphical glitch? But no, it's the snowstorm. Holy crap. You can barely see what's... You can barely see what this storm going on outside. This is kind of scary. Let's get out of here. I don't like that. Probably when I get far, far away. Blah. Far enough away, it's going to go boom. Uh... Oh, hell no. I don't... I don't want to go in there, man. God damn it. Because of the broken down generator, this door isn't functioning properly and prevents you from going through safely. Oh, shit. I don't like this. I have a feeling something bad's gonna happen. Not that something already hasn't, but I mean... Shit got real. Oh, this isn't good. Frank and I are probably the only ones left. Well, this seems normal. This is one of the hallways, blah, 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 blah. Door leading north has oil around it. You hear some printing noises coming from the control room. You decide to investigate it first. Okay. Oh, the weather? 
one of the monitors is printing like crazy. Oh, crap. Yeah, look, it's spamming a message. Get off my land. Get off my land! Damn kids! That is creepy. That is creepy. But I'm not scared. Okay, maybe a little. Oh my god. Yeah, there's no day five for this. Shit, shit's already gone down. Oh sh! Yeah. Jeez, that door makes a nice guillotine, but I can see you've already found that one out for yourself. Well, the other one gave me a warning. Oh, brutal. I like it. Props to whoever put that in. Wait, did I already read the monitor after the save? Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. We'll just read it again so we can be certain. Yeah, okay. I get it. Get off my land, get off my land. Let's just save to make sure. Well, let's try going into those rooms, I guess. Oh, the lab. Oh, I really don't want to go in there. Let's try going into the doctor's room first. Oh, oh shit. Is that the doctor? Holy shit, man. You know, doctor's practice. There's oil everywhere. Well, suspects are quickly narrowing down. Oh my god. My god, it's it's Dr. Benson! He's badly mutilated with a scalpel. Looks like someone was playing Trauma Center and they failed. Dr. Benson's been cut up terribly with a scalpel, which is still sticking out of his chest. Oh man. Can I take the scalpel? Pull the knife out of Dr. Benson's chest. His body moves briefly because of the pulling. Oh, I actually do need that. Or at least I can get that. Well... There's bloody writing on the wall. Yeah, I know. It's empty in a wall. Okay. That's not a. Uh, it's not foreboding at all. This room is messed up already. I, I really don't want to go in this room, man. Oh, okay. I guess it won't let me go in there at all. We'll leave it at that. The game wouldn't let me. I can't go up there. That door over there is messed up, so I have to go this way. It's going to force me down this path. Now, that's weird. There's nothing here. Don't pop up. Don't. This door seems to be malfunctioning because of the generator error and is blocking your way. Ugh. Oh, I don't have the pickaxe anymore. Fuck. Uh... Been great with hands. Well, fine then. Yeah, we'll just bash it open. I don't know. Every time I go through a new screen, I think something's gonna pop out. Maybe I can go back to uh to Frank. Cause the air is blocking that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Gonna get killed here. Nope. I can't go up there regardless. Okay. Frank, any progress? Any progress, man, because you and I are the only ones left. It's a good thing we were... Okay, scratch that. I'm the only one left. Oh, shit. Where is Bates? He hasn't finished working on the generator, so where is he? <sighs> he can't be the killer. He can't, unless he's in. He only sees cahoots with with William. <sighs> Don't 
don't like this at all. Where the hell is he? He's gonna be up there dead. This game got... Not like full on scary, but it got creepy. It did. Use matches. Well, okay. Thought maybe he'd be dead up here. So he's not in there. I still can't go that way, and it still doesn't look nice in there. I don't know if that's blood or oil. God, Frank, are you in here? No. Frank, where the hell are you? Sparks. There's a panel near the upper door. Uh... You managed to remove the panel. Oh! Okay. The open panel is, re uh, is revealing its hidden treasures. Wires. Bingo! You cut the wires. Now the crazed door stops its deadly motions. The blade of the scalpel snaps, so you throw the knife away. Ah, fuck! We're really close to the end of the game here, though. Am I ready? Jeez Louise, man. Saving every room along the way, because this is... This is horrible. Oops, I hit down. Whoa! Someone took out the whole walls. A lot of oil here, and, and the way to the west seems to be blocked. Oh, my God. I don't want to go in here. Forget it. I'm going to be a man. I'm going to be a man and, and shit myself. You're inside what used to be the bar. The whole place is covered in oil. Oh, man, and with the explosion that's definitely going to happen, this whole place is going to go sky high. Holy shit. Lisa, no, not you as well. And the lights here are malfunctioning as well. Oh, no, 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 don't do that. Oh, fuck, man, that... Did that door open? That door wasn't open when I came in. Oh, fuck. Can I use the toilet amidst, amidst all this? No time for that now, Mike. It's the restroom. Lisa is sitting in a puddle of her own blood. Okay, the suspect list is really narrowing down. I still haven't seen heads or tails of William. Where did Frank go? Uh, there's Owen, Sarah. I think everyone else is already dead. Ugh. I don't want to go past this door. Stop flashing, screen. That's scaring me. Whoa, okay, that was ill-timed. It scared me there. Lisa is heavily bleeding. Wait a minute, is she still breathing? Lisa, Lisa, are you okay? Do, uh, do I look okay, Mr. Goodman? Here, let me help you. Let me be, Mr. Goodman. These wounds are fatal. I'll die soon, so listen. What happened? Don't know. Watson and I were attacked from behind. Ouch! Was it the Eskimo spirit? The Eskimo spirit? <laughs> there is no spirit here in Mary. What? What do you mean? I didn't... I never felt any presence of any ghost, Mr. Goodman. I normally do, but he in here in Mary? Nothing. <laughs> what are you trying to say, Miss McIntyre? <laughs> Urgh! What I'm trying to say, Mike, is that our Eskimo spirit is an actual human being. What? You heard me. All this killing is the work of a man. Or woman. But why? Don't know. I do know that this killer also operated during the previous expedition, terrorizing William's father, Maxwell Mayfield. But that means William Mayfield is in great danger, too. You're right, Goodman. Ouch. Well... Considering that we seem to be nearing the end of the game, but I want to make sure I have plenty of time for any ending credits and whatnot. 
<laughs> I'm going to end it here in this nasty-ass bathroom now with a dying Lisa. And in the next part, we will most likely finish this game. Or get killed. Either way. See you guys in the next one.